Hello friends, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to download and install HP LaserJet Tang MFP1005 printer driver in a Windows 11 PC or laptop. It is a very easy and simple process. So let's go to our video. First, we download our printer driver. Go to the any web browser that you like. Here, type your printer name HP LaserJet Tang MFP. 10005 printer driver hit enter key first link is from the support.hp.com official website of the hp printer open the first link here we find the our printer name but one problem it's not give a proper driver so go to the here choose a different os click on it here select windows and go to the version in version scroll down and find windows 7 64 bit because Windows 11 is always 64 bit. So go to the Windows 7 64 bit and click on the update. And here we find the our proper driver. This is the our proper driver installation software and full basic drivers. Scroll down and here we find our drivers. Both drivers are same. Click on any drivers. This or this. I click on the first driver. Click on download. It's redirect me to the another page. Wait for a few seconds to download to complete. After download, we go to the, our next step. At the top, here we find download. Our download is completed. Go to the downloads. Click on show in folder. Drag this setup file to desktop. Close it. Here we find our setup file. And this setup file is actually G file. And we are going to unzip this G file. Right click on it. Click on show more options. Click on extract files. Click on OK. It's extract our files, wait for a few seconds. It's extract our files and create a new file or new folder on our desktop, wait for a few seconds. It's create a new file on the desktop, double click on it. Double click on drivers and here we find our drivers and we are going to install it, close it. For installation, there are two steps. First, double click, on, double click on these drivers and install it. Or second is the best way, go to the manual installation, go to the start. You type printers and scanners. And click on the printers and scanners. In a printers and scanner, in a printers and scanner, here we find add a printer or scanner. Here we find add a device. Click on add a device. Wait for a few seconds, new options are pop up. Here we find new option add a new device manually. Click on add a new device manually. Close this. Here we find add a printer. In add a printer, we find many options. Go to the last option, add a local printer or network printer with manual settings. Select that. Click on the next. Here we find existing port. It is in most IMP part. Click at here. And if you find any port name dot four underscore zero zero one HP printer device, HP device or HP, then select that. If you not find any HP port, the next option is USB. Select any USB port. USB zero zero one, USB zero zero two, USB zero zero three. 004 select any USB port. I select USB 001. Click on the next. Here we find Havadix. Click on Havadix. Go to the browse. Go to the desktop. Select the our newly created folder. Double click on it or extracted folder. Double click on driver. Here we find our driver. Select any file. All files are same. Select any file. Click on open. Click on OK. Here we find two four files. Select any file that you want. Both are same. Click on next. Give any name that you like. I give the HP LaserJ Tang MFP1005. Click on next. Wait for a few seconds. It's installed now. If you want to share printer on network, then select last option. I don't, so I select. Do not share this printer. Click on next. If you want to print a test page, then click on a printer test page or click on a finish. Next step, next step is check our printer is properly working or not. Go to start. Printers and scanners. Click on the printers and scanners. And if you find your printer name HP LaserJ Tank MFP1005, that means your printer is properly installed and it's work 110% on your Windows 11 PC or laptop. So guys, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, share, comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you guys.